Ladies and gentlemen, from the Gotham headquarters to your homes around the world, or maybe even the galaxy, if aliens are watching this, I would like to wish you all a Merry Christmas. And if you're not celebrating that, happy holidays. And if you're not celebrating the holidays, you're just a grumpy, crappy person. Now, my holiday present to all of you is a beautifully wrapped, absolutely mint condition episode of your favorite series, Guess the Elo. This episode delivers on all fronts. We honestly could not have asked for a better holiday present. This episode is a train wreck. You're going to laugh like you've never laughed before. I guarantee it. I got nothing else to say. No sponsors, nothing. Let's just get into the games. We've got Gotham Sub beginning us with the move E4. Uh, I like where this is going. C5. Knight F3, Knight C6, D4. Okay, we got Magnus Carlsen with the black pieces versus Bozo McFrozo with the, with the white pieces. Magnus goes for... Okay, never mind. That's not... Magnus likes Knight F6, E5. He likes the Sveshnikov. Uh, D6 is the stoner Sicilian. I just named it this because that's not a real opening. Um, black never really plays that move right now. But it quickly becomes a dragon these nuts across your face Sicilian. So, uh... Uh, this is uh, this is the dragon, and so the plans here are for white to play queen d2 long castle uh, and checkmate, and black will play like this and sometimes checkmate white, but most of the time lose. Uh, you can play something known as the Yugoslav attack. Look that up. That might give you some like random civil war stuff, but like about chess. Okay, very good. Now, oh, not very good. Uh, you're supposed to play f3. This move prevents knight g4. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, and, and, and also F3, per, like, starts up your attack. Uh, castles, castles, and, um, oh, yeah, sorry, YouTube, I'm gonna hide music now. You can't know we have music here. Come over here, though, we got music. Uh, yeah, Black, uh, doesn't know their opening. Knight G4 is, like, borderline winning. Um, so, this is, like, crushing. Uh, this is really, really bad, because you're gonna get this bishop. Um, yeah, so here, boom, boom, bishop h6. Yeah, this is fine, except you haven't actually started the attack. And if anybody's attacking someone, it's actually black attacking white. But okay, bishop b7, that's all right. h4, uh, white probably takes, right? No! f3 now, okay. Okay, we don't hate it, we don't hate it. Okay, what the, f what is that? What? What even is the point of rook e8? Does black understand anything about chess? Like, you're supposed to go here, you're supposed to, like, boop, boop. Like... What... What is this? Why? H... Okay, ta I, to, is it to go bishop h8? Are we sure about that? I think black just sucks. I don't... Like, what is this? Why would you put your bishop behind the pawn? Like, why wouldn't you put it... I don't know. I j I, it's not my job to play the good moves. My, my job is to analyze the games and make fun of them. That's, and then for, you know, random people to look at the game and be like, he's so mean. Great. Perfect. H5. Uh, golden rule. H4, H5. What is with black and playing every piece one square? Like, rookie eight, queen, c7, bishop b7. Black is better off being like a duster, you know? Just dusting, like... Like, uh, whatever. Pans and everything. I mean, what is the next move is gonna be rook b8 or like h6. Oh, yeah, yeah, there's another one, one square. Beautiful. I like how black is just putting the queen off center. Like, wh wh the whole point of the Sicilian is to attack. h5, come on. Good. So basically, at some point in this game, a person woke up and the other one still sucks. Yes. Yes. Oh my god. Yes, yes, yes. Right there, right there. Yes. The queen h6, yes, now take, or take, take, don't go g5. Knight e4, queen h7. Ah, uh, but now you allow this. No, but now you're going to have to work ten times as hard. Well, probably not against this opponent, but... This is actually not terrible, but now you have bishop c4 simply. Yo, what is this? Like, white played, like, complete poopy, and then, uh, for, or, like, didn't play, uh, didn't allow knight g4, and now... And, and what is this? And now every, everything white is playing is stockfish choice. Okay, another stockfish move? Yo. How in the middle of all this? Homie pulls up here with rook ad8, and then if queen takes, then there's this. Like, that is insane. 
Bishop d3, okay, queen g4. Was bishop d3 the top engine move? No. Okay, so you're not cheating. Good. Queen g4? What? So you could like, why? what? For what? Why'd you play this move? So you could move your bishop? Boss. All right, okay. All right, all right. You're playing good. You're playing very well. You're playing very well. Stockfish is agreeing with everything you're saying. I'm not, I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm not acute. I'm just, I'm saying Stockfish gives you the blessing. Everything you're playing, you, White hasn't played any cheater moves. Like everything White's done is very natural. I'm just, Knight H5. Like for example, if you had played Knight F2 here, cheater 100%. Like, you, you see, like if you played, I, it's cheating. Like no one plays Knight F2. That's a stupid move. You're gonna play like rook g1, rook f1, so... See? I'm not... Queen g2. How are you actually going to win this? What? Oh my god. Yeah, 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 oh my... Yeah, uh, god. Oh, and of course, black just pulls up with the... Like, imagine having a knight, a queen, a bishop, and two rooks, and just like playing this. Like... With, with instead of resigning, you just play the most random c5 of all time. And you just lose immediately. I mean, I, I yeah, I, wow. I'm getting like 12, 1300 vibes from this game. I, I have like an immediate, I think white like has potential in chess and black has potential as a janitor. I mean, janitors are very important, but like the janitor of their own room, so unemployed. Um, anyway. Uh, yeah, so let's, uh, let's pull up the game. Uh, let's go. Wow, 1600. So, I want to just apologize to my sub, because, sub, you actually played well. I didn't say 1300 because of you. I said it because of your opponent. Your opponent doesn't even deserve the house where they are the janitor. All right? Uh, listen, Jim Bean, you're probably a nice guy, but this is one of the worst games you've probably ever played. And the fact that you even get a 63% for this, you should get a 26.9 for this. I mean, that was... Here's what I mean, by the way. Uh, can I just quickly point this out on a serious note? I'm going to take this back to the full screen. This game is exactly why... Nobody should play the Sicilian defense. And, and I'm sorry, but how are you going to play one of the most violent, tactically rich, fascinating, and complicated, and constantly getting analyzed openings and just play like a complete ditz? Like Bishop B7? I mean, the, you, you, the moves you are playing are an insult to the opening. Anyway, let's go to the second game. Like, 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 White played a beautiful game. White played a good game. Attacked one. That was, that was great. I like it. I mean, why not just play Carl Khan at that point? Anyway. E4. D6. You know? I just, I know, I mean, I'm serious. Like, stop playing openings you, okay. Um, stop playing openings you don't understand at all. Uh, wow. This isn't what Okay. The the guy who submitted this game donated $50 and said, please analyze my game. And and I did it, not because I can be bought, but actually I was scrolling in the Discord channel and I conveniently saw it. Uh but uh yeah, so listen, because you donated $50 to the channel, um, you would think I'm gonna be extra nice to you. I'm not. Boss, I don't know what you think you're doing here, like reinventing chess. Boss, you're supposed to put the knights out first. For a reason. Because when you put the bishops out too quickly, they can just be chopped. Like, you don't know where the bishops go. You know the knights go here. You better have developed the knights next. No, I mean, what are you, what are, what, what are you, Christopher Columbus taking credit for, for, for discovering uh, the, the continent? Oh, oh, look at me. Like, no, nah, bro, you had no clue what you're doing. What is this? He's gonna push a fifth pawn. Oh, all right, knight f3. And you know what the best part is? Because black put up no resistance, white has the absolute golden sandbox of openings right here. Black did absolutely nothing like to combat this. Black was like, oh, wow. 
Oh, wow. Like, why could... See? See what I mean? You knew your knights were gonna go there. You knew. But okay, fine. E6. Yes, of course. Black is like plus two on move ten. What is... What are we... What are we doing? Anyway, so when you have a big space advantage, uh, what you need to do is you need to, like, go through, right? You need to push through and at some point. So, yes, I love it. I love it. This is not the four pawns attack. Uh, this is one guy who got to push four pawns and another guy who is actively just tying his shoes together. Like, imagine someone is punching you in the face and rather than fighting back, you're like making it even harder for yourself to get up and fight back. That's basically what's happening here. Um, probably the best move here is like C5. Look at that. Look at that top engine suggest One of the top engine moves, like B4, C5, to just completely clamp down and put your knight here. And that's never going to happen. Um, now black actually can maybe get counterplay. Okay, knight A6. I don't hate it. Uh-huh. But C5 now. And, and, and look at this. This is the problem when you overextend. A pawn break and your whole position falls apart. Crazy. Of course, black doesn't play it. It's much better to attack a bishop. Bishop f6. Okay. Okay. Yes, absolutely. Okay, so let's say you have the option to fly out into the sky or trap your bishop forever. No, of course. Of course, put the bishop in prison and never move it out again. No, I mean, come on. It's, this person has an enlightened understanding of chess. I mean, like, uh, I mean, imagine you can go here and control the whole diagonal, and instead you just, you do this. I mean, this is one of the stupidest moves I've ever seen. I mean, just simply. Like, the choice is not hard. What is the choice? Well, one day I'll get out! No, no, you won't. No, you won't. Gee, oh, <laughs> see, White's like, okay, I'm gonna clamp, I'm gonna clamp in. <laughs> And the craziest part is this is fine because here black uh, white blundered rook takes d4 and it's a draw. That's incredible. That's incredible. Queen d4, queen g3. Who donated 50? I'm not making fun of the person who's playing black. The person who donated is playing with white. If the person who was playing with black played bishop h8, I would refund them the money and then I would call the cops. It's a draw now. You blunder a draw, so the bishop on h8 actually does, does survive. Okay, e5. Now d5, please. Yes, very good. What is that? What, why? Okay, check, but now queen blocks. That's the problem. Uh-huh, check, okay. Yes, and now you're just hanging mate. I mean, it's simply mate. Yeah, or you have to sack the rook. Incredible. This is what happens when your king surround him, uh, surrounds himself with snakes. You see, the king doesn't actually have good backup. They're fake. They're fake friends, right? They, uh, they, they're, they're, gonna, they're gonna watch the king die. And so the other people have to make the sacrifice. It's crazy. And now, now a very easy way to win. Rooks, pawn, that's it. That's how the game should end. Okay, I don't know why you lost the pawn, but that's not my business. Okay. Ah, but now the bishop gets out. Okay, so you're a rook up. G great. Yes. Check, trade queen, beautiful. You don't need to do any of this. Good. Yes, yes, yes. Fantastic. Okay. That was actually not a bad game. That was... That was good. Um, okay, so you have a very unique way of playing opening. So at, at what level are you arrogant enough to, like, play your own way and not actually play openings, but then, like, still do some good stuff in a game? Mm. A thousand to eleven hundred, this game. Yeah, that's, yeah. It may be, may, yeah, if you're below 1,000 and playing like that, that's actually incredibly impressive. 1,000 to 1,100. Yo, black is 1,400? Yo, today is the day when my poor subs are getting 300 points deducted from their rating, and it's because of, the per it's because of their opponent. Yo, my, like, my sub played a normal game, but I mean, how is black 1,400? Like... There are people in this world who are legitimately in, in deep mental health crisis because they think they will never get to 1400. And here you have this person, Alejandro Miranda Flores. I mean, might be the nicest person in the world, honestly. But oh my god, I mean, the guy had the option between playing bishop h8 and bishop h6. And homie played bishop h8 as a 1400. Yo, Labib, I just want to apologize to you, all right? Labibi, Habibi, Labibi. You played a good game. I made fun of you, but you played well. 
How the hell was that dude 1400, bro? I... You know, if we're on YouTube, I hope there's like an ad break right now. Just like we, we, I mean, oh my God. What was the time control? It doesn't matter what the time control was. Crazy. Ridiculous. I mean, I'm, I'm so sad. That was good. Say Habibi one more time. Habibi, you got it, you got it, you got it. All right, game three. I mean, yo, you guys are finding some, some, some... You know, like in boxing, when they pad the record in the beginning, that's what you guys are finding right now. You guys are finding those people who fight once and you never hear from again. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm going to skip that. Uh, we got a TTS. He said, Levi, your collab with Tirzu. My name's not Tirzu, but my deepest apologies for calling you Levi. Oh. Oh, oh, you called me Levi a year ago. It's all good. Yo, what the f... Why are you playing a Caro Navian? If you're gonna play a Scandi, why are you playing C6? What? Why are you playing a a, 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 a Scandi arrow, a Scandaro? I, I, what? What? What does Queenie do? Oh my God! Yo, you know what the craziest thing is? This is horrible for White. Like Bishop F3 and, and Black is big vibing. Because the pawns are damaged. I mean, you'll beat anybody in this position. Oh my god. E6. Yeah, now black plays normal. I mean, dude, just keep developing pieces. Stop moving your queen. Okay, fine. Ah, now you can even play bishop before. Okay, so, you know, you play a Skandaro. Obviously, your opponent should go knight c3 and b plus 2 on move 4. Um, but instead of that, they play queen e2, which is, like, almost as stupid as bishop h8 from last game. Um, and, uh, no, you paid this person, right? Like, you, you, you must have paid them. What is bishop takes b8? What is bishop b8? I mean, what? What is this move? I mean, this is why you guys, what, you guys should turn off this setting called, uh, show legal moves. Because what happens is you do this, and you go, oh, I can't take horse. Bip. Like, just turn it off. Turn off that setting. You don't need to know the legal moves because then you're going to get yourself in trouble. All right? Thank you for the five gifted subs. You should give it to White's chess fund. Oh my God. I mean, just queen a2. It's unbelievable. Queen a2. Jesus. Okay. Okay, queen b2? What? Did you submit a game where you just killed someone? Oh, you hung a rook. By accident. You hung two rooks by accident, and yet you still have mate. Okay, you have mate in one, which you'll never find. You will never find that move. It's an incredible move. You will never find it, because it's pinned. Yeah. Okay, queen d2. Okay. Okay. You win this game, right? You must win this game. Okay. Okay, okay, I'm starting to not be so convinced, but okay, you just remembered you had pawns. Okay, very good. I mean, I, admittedly, you, you played uh, sus, but you won. You won. Um, okay. Oh, uh, God. Um, queen d5, Jesus Christ. Uh, queen e2, I mean... Like, between 7 and 800. Seven and eight hundred, probably. I mean, white was so. I mean, come on. Yo, white is thirteen hundred. White, white is thirteen hundred. Merry effing Christmas. I mean, who are these? Who are these people? Who are these people? There was a brilliant move? Oh, yeah, I mean, I mean, the engine is just a piece of crap. Like, look at this, it's minus 14. You can literally take a dump. The move where Black accidentally hung two rooks? No, was this planned? Did you plan hanging two rooks? Is that what you did? Is that why it's brilliant? If you actually blundered two rooks on purpose, that's pretty, that's pretty badass. If you got lucky, it's fine. 
Guys, I... The eye is playing right now. It, listen, Ishmael, you might be the nicest guy ever, but what is going on today? Guys, what is happening today? What is happening today? This is... I've never been more wrong in my life. I literally guessed a rating that was like 600 points off. It has nothing to do with me. I mean, I just... Wow. I mean, it's just insane. Okay. Please, let's get this game right. Okay. Vienna. It's not even a bad move. C6. Okay. No, but why? But why Queen E7? No, but I mean, why Queen E7? Why? Like, what? What is, what is this? No, but come on! I mean, what is this? I mean, it's like plus two already! I mean, castles, knight g3, knight f5. Crack the center with d4. No, but how are you going to go from this to g3? I mean, why would you... What, why would you invite this? How are you just losing? You're losing if you play like this. You cannot prevent this from happening. You're losing now. King h1, you hang mate. Of course, black play- I mean, what is a5? Are you people finding people? Like, is this what's going on here? How did I manage to select, out of like 70 submissions, four of the stupidest games ever in the history of Guess the Elo? Of course, of course, yes, yes. In the middle of a colossal struggle between all the army, these two go meet in the woods to, 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 to diddle around with one another, okay? A5, A4, the pawns were trying to get some freaky action going on. Bishop back to e6, okay, f4, aha, that was the game plan, okay, okay, yes, f6, man, you know, I'm scared because I, 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 I know that white is better here, but I, I don't think white is capable of winning this, uh-huh, yeah, like king g2, I mean, God gave you, you know, seven pawns, two knights, a bishop, queen, two rooks, but king g2, like, what, is the king gonna go fight on the light squares? I mean, why king g2? For what? Like, what are you trying to accomplish? You're trying to play rook h1, queen g1. I mean, I just, I, I don't know, guys. Like, uh, you know, you have to finish development. Bishop e3. Okay, you want to play a pawn move, play g4 to go like this. Okay. My kids say you're funny? Welcome to the stream. Um, no, what, what you have is called, uh, is called a condition. There, there, there are no kids. You're imagining them. Sorry, I'm in a roasty mood tonight. On a serious note, please tell your kids their favorite streamer says hello. And if you legitimately don't have kids and you made that up, then go get that checked out. Knight to f6. Okay, so White was winning for like half a move. Uh, it's a little bit more violent here on, tw on Twitch, by the way. Your wife wants to cheat on me with you. No, 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 no. Now you are imagining that you, <laughs> you, <laughs> no, <laughs> no, there's definitely no wife. <laughs> Come on. Oh, stop, stop, stop. No, you, that you're imagining, that you're imagining. Rook takes f6. Of course, when in doubt, just sack the rook for the knight for no reason. Just sack the rook for the knight for zero reason. No reason. Just sack it. Whatever. What's the worst that could happen? Rook f1. Yeah, there's, that's it. There's no attack. Now, white can win this if white gets a knight to f5. If white can play knight e2, knight g3, knight f5, white will probably win. I see no other way. Maybe sack? Oh, that's what's going to happen. Some crazy thing and the queen is going to get kicked out in queen f7, right? Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Like I said, yeah. White, I mean, white is a genius. c5 is a great move to try to get in the bishop. Knight d7 only move, never going to be played. And now it takes, takes, and does white find only stockfish move? Bishop takes, G, bishop takes g5. What is that? C5, bishop takes 
Bishop c5 is the idea. Incredible. Bishop c5. Knight c6. Oh my goodness. Rook f7. Oh, the whole point of moving the king away from f7 is to get in, but you just see a check. You're like, oh, check. Yay. Yay. Okay. Knight to b5. But you know what's incredible about this position? Like, do you think black will ever play knight d8? No. Obviously not. Obviously not. Like, I mean, white is playing a bunch of normal moves and black's top engine defenses are ridiculous to find. And black doesn't find. Yo. How are you gonna play a bunch of moves and then just not even let- you just develop the knight and just hang the bishop in one move? It's not even the best move. E4 is better. Okay. Yeah, now, now by a miracle, queen f7 is vibe. Queen f7. Okay. Counterattack. Knight to e5. Just very confidently hanging the knight. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. So now you're down nine points of material. So, folks, this is guess the elo, right? So, black can go king b8 and be minus 11, or king d8 and maiden 6. Obviously, it's going to be king d8, right? <laughs> okay, <laughs> I mean, why? <laughs> yeah, uh, rook f7, and, and, and now, now finally the prophecy is fulfilled. And you know, this game is kind of what happens when you play a game without moving both rooks. You deserve to lose. And the craziest part is, black resigned. Like, black didn't even play knight b8 to try to stop maze. I mean, black just resigned. I mean, it's losing, but you never know. Black just resigned. Wow. I mean, what a game. What a game. Six to seven hundred. Six to seven hundred. I mean, gotta be, right? Like, maybe seven to eight, but I'm gonna say six to seven hundred. Oh my god, here we go. I'm, I'm good. You all have a great night. Um, that was a 1540 versus a 1559. Listen, it's been great. Uh, listen, um... Y'all, y'all, y'all trash as hell, bro. Y'all mad trash. Y'all the, you guys suck. You suck. All right. I've the, 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 the stupid. No, no. I can't even find the words. I can't even find the words to describe my emotions right now. Y'all trash as hell. Y'all trash. Trash. Okay? Okay? And YouTube, you should be disgusted on my behalf. Do you see how mad chat is? There is not a single person who looks at this and says it's okay. No, not a single one. No, y'all both need to go to jail. Like, put them in jail. Right to jail. Thank you to Anonymous for 10 gifted subs, but right to jail. Right away. No, 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 no. You, no. You, 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 you playing like this? No, right to jail. No. And, oh, you know what? I, you know what? I don't even believe that this was a real game. MD Francisco is probably your friend. They're not. MD Francisco is not your friend. You just... You just legit played that game. Okay. Well, listen. Um, I mean, I'm pissed. Uh, yeah, I, I... I mean... Okay. And you know the craziest part is we got one more game. The craziest part is we're not even done. We are not even done. We got one more game. We got one more game. We're not even done. That's the craziest part. All right, Scandy. <laughs> oh, this is going to be good. Queen F3 on move two, y'all. Queen F3. We this is the best guest that you episode ever. Officially, this is the best legit. Yeah, I'm, I'm, we're witnessing history. This is great. This entire episode has been the biggest disaster I've ever recorded. Easily. And there's been like 40 episodes or something. This is unbelievable. We can't miss. Knight to F... Oh my god. D3. And now black should just go for a Karo Khan. Okay, take, take. E5. Good. Knight E2. Good. Anytime they bring a queen out early, just slap them. Alright. Queen... But the danger here is overextending. Like, don't play knight takes E4. Um, it's, it's, it's not easy here because this is hanging. 
Like, you can play b6. b6 is a very human move. It's not the top engine move, but it's a very human move. I mean, why did they go queen b3? Like, what? All right, okay. Okay. All right, queen back. Knight a6. Knight g3. Uh, do you think black is going to hang a queen with bishop b5? That's so lucky. And yet I still think bishop b5 is fine. Wait, sorry. Why is bishop b5 not very good? Long castle and mate. Oh. 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 Dis. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's gross nah 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 nobody can see that straight off the bat that's crazy that would even take it like a that would take a GM a move or two to be like what long that's disgusting oh my god I mean no one would have seen that oh that's mate it's literally mate oh it's mate it's, <laughs> it's mate it's still mate it's still mate okay bishop a6 just take it <laughs> How are you gonna pick the knight up but not take the bishop? How are you gonna pick the knight up but not take- I'm just, I'm dying! How are you gonna block- Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is insanity! This is insanity! Oh. <laughs> okay. So, white is winning by going here, removing the guard of the- of the- I mean, that's never gonna happen. Yo, there are so many dangers getting leveled here. So the bishop is hanging, the queen is hanging, but the bishop can take this. Instead, the rook takes. Instead, homie pulls up with the rook to get the... Yo, rather than just calmly getting the, the, the extra piece, he sacks the rook for the two pieces. Okay. Okay, just take the rook. Nope, no problem. Nice. And now, now white is just uh, lost. I mean, I mean, just yeah, it's just over. You can just take on c2. You just need to not blunder anything over here. Look, I saw queen a4. I just didn't like it. Man played rook d7. That is such a trash move. It's so trash. Why would you literally pin yourself two ways? Queen e8 wins the queen because of geometry. Also, rook d2 and queen d7. Bishop b7. Yo, guys. If you pin yourselves, you, you you gotta you gotta stop. You gotta stop. You gotta you you need to stop. 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 Stop doing this. Stop. You need you need help. Stop pinning your own pieces. Just play King B8. Rook D2 and oh my god, it's over now. King D8. Okay, so at the very least, take. And at the end, bishop versus everybody. Okay, queen g8. Trash, but not so bad. Okay, queen c4 was hung, 100%, but queen d7 now. Yeah, super lucky. <gasps> Knight takes queen. Oh, incredible. Incredible. I don't think we're out of the woods yet. I feel like there's more memes. No, it looks, that's it. There's no way you can screw this up. I can't, yo, I can't, I, I, this is, this is the best thing I've ever seen. Oh my God. 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 Oh my Lord. Oh my, I mean, yo. All right. So to avoid blunders like this, to avoid hanging a full queen in a position where you have made in two, um, what you need to do is slap the shit out of yourself. Like just that's number one step two make sure you're playing checks and step three make sure if you're not playing checks you're at least looking at how they can check you so if you're gonna play queen f2 don't just be like mm, queen to f2 yes and delectable and then i will be delivering a mate they have one move that attacks you the fact that you don't look at that is just travesty i hate you oh my god i hate you and i still think it's not over yeah i think black is still gonna win with the epon yep of course. I mean, why, yeah, like, why wouldn't you just move the rook aimlessly and allow black full activity and then just to promote the e-pawn, right? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's going to be rook h7, knight g5. Okay, some miracle. Uh-huh. Uh-oh, e2. Okay. Yeah, it's a draw, but of course it won't be. 
Oh, you let the king get behind the pawn. You let the king get behind the pawn, big boss. What is happening? What is this? Oh, by the way, knight f5 not possible because pin. But it's going to be possible. There's no way it's, it doesn't get blundered. Oh, I'm so scared. Oh my god. It's going to happen. It's got to happen. At some point, it's got to happen. Is it just a draw? No, it's actually a draw. They repeated moves. I have no idea what their rating is. I... I just legit don't know. I mean, I, I, I really just don't know, guys. I mean, I... I, I want... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna say, like, 700. Like, it's... It... I... Six, like, seven. I mean, that... Yeah, that... That's... Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. For the first time in my life, 792 versus 829. Thank God. Thank I was ready for this game to be like 220-100s, man. That was going to be one of the dumbest things I've ever witnessed in my life. Oh, my Lord.